Dad, yeah, mate. give us a bit of the history of uh, Bonacera. Bonnie. Yes, Bonnie. She was built in 1966 by a guy called Eric Wing with the help of another guy called Chris McMullen who was a boat builder. And they were only 17, 18, 19. And uh, they built it under a suburban house in Mount Eden in Auckland over lots of beers, lots of camaraderie. And uh, yes, as young teenagers, they produced this boat and uh, had a hell of a lot of fun with her. She was the second 22 foot mullet boat to be built in the glued double diagonal method. And uh, while she didn't win too many races, they had, a, as I said, they had a lot of fun in her, and Eric had her for about five or six years. And then she was sold to another family who had her for 25 years. Um, I think she had about three owners, and then we bought, we bought her off the owner that had her for 25 years. And uh, he was happy for the boat to go to us. And um, she was in good condition when we got her. We did a little bit more to tart her up and make it easy for Annie and I to sail and we're having a hell of a lot of fun with her. She is, uh, her registered number is L43. And she's one of about, say 20 mullet boats left in various states of repair and disrepair. At the moment, there's a probably a fleet of about 12 that are still fairly active in the Ponsonby Cruising Club. And the rest of them are either rotting away in backyards or up creeks somewhere. And uh, we're going to try and get them all together and revive the fleet a little bit. Sounds lovely. Well, let's uh, get on board. Buona sera. Permission to, uh, to go aboard, Captain? Permission to... Permission granted. Born as era, Signorina, born as era. It is time to say goodnight to Napoli. Though it's hard for me to whisper, born as era. With that old moon above the Mediterranean Sea. Well, in the morning, Signorina will go. Annie asked the question, where did the name Bonacera come from? And he said it came from a, an old pop song that we all used to rock on to. Um, I can't remember the guy's name, but he was a, a, a British pop song singer in the late 50s with a, a Latino name. I can't remember it now. And they all used to bop onto this this song where it had a line in it where Bonacera my darling or something like that. And he decided to name the boat after that song. Well in the morning we see the arena we'll go walking Where the mountains and the sun come into sight And near that little jewelry shop we'll stop and linger Oh while I buy a wedding Come on then, I dare you.